how do you know your most fertile time or window, um, which really relates to trying at home on your own. When you come to a fertility clinic and start treatment, they will typically figure that out for you. They'll monitor ovulation with blood work and ultrasound and the like. But to figure this out at home, uh, there's a few um, options. Having a regular cycle is pretty critical. If your cycle is very erratic, then figuring out your fertile window or time is, is pretty hard for anybody. But if you have a regular cycle, whether it's every 26 days, 28 days, 30 days, 32 days, etc., it, it's fine. It doesn't matter which of those intervals it is, as long as it's consistent every month. For example, <clears throat> if you have a 30-day cycle, then a rule of thumb is to subtract 14 days. Normally from the time you ovulate until your period is about 14 days. So 30 minus 14 is day 16. Your best guess is I'm ovulating around day 16. If you want to refine this further, you could then estimate the day of ovulation, in this case day 16 with the 30-day cycle, and start testing your urine with a home LH predictor kit about three days before, in this case on day 13. And if you tested negative on day 13, negative day 14, but had a surge or a positive test on day 15, then that would suggest I'm ovulating the next day i.e. on day 16. So that would allow you to have timed intercourse on the day that the LH kit is predicting ovulation. If you don't test your urine, then estimating your ovulation by the rule of thumb of cycle length minus 14 would be your next best option. Again, in this case, day 16 is your predicted day of ovulation. And then have intercourse every other day around that time. So have intercourse day 14, 16, 18 and you've sort of surrounded plus or minus two days the likely time of ovulation, assuming your cycle is regular. So I hope that helps you uh, with timing uh, your attempts at pregnancy uh, at home, possibly before coming to get your fertility clinic's help. Thanks.